Hey guys, Nikki here, and I am back with a luxury haul. This one is going to be short and sweet, not a lot of purses and all that. My focus is really perfume and accessories or jewelry this time. Um, this probably will be my last luxury haul because the street's just too hot right now, and I ain't got time for it, okay? <laughs> Slash over here doing the gangsta lean, y'all, and I'm not about to take it off and start all over. So I don't need to hear about it in the comments, okay? So as always, we're gonna start off a luxury haul with Dossier. You guys know I work with Dossier. I love the company. They have inspired by fragrances that um or inspired by our favorite niche and designer fragrances i absolutely love dossier um their bottles start at 29 dollars for like lower end designer fragrances and then go all the way up to like 59 they have an incentive program called catch at the end when you check out where you can sign up and get rewards and points and all of that um and i have been working with them for a minute and i don't have any complaints i absolutely love them as an alternative to my niche bottles because they can be like three four hundred dollars a bottle so I get this and like spray it with it so I don't have to use so much of my high end. I get this um, just because I love fragrances, guys. So if I want to try a fragrance, I try Dossier's first. And then if I like it a whole lot, I get it. Um, it's just a good company. So guys, I got all of these new fragrances. I will go through them really, really quick, and I do have a link below with a discount code, so make sure you check them out. So this is how your package will come if you decide to use Dossier. There's a cheat card is what I call it in here that tells you what the name of the scent is, the notes, what it's inspired by, the concentration on most of them is 18%, and how it works, okay? So this one is inspired by Tom Ford Jasmine Rouge, and it is called Floral Jasmine. I do not have this scent at all, so I'm going to test this on me a little bit and then if I really really like it I will get the Tom Ford version but if I if it's okay I will be just fine with the Dossier version they have a magnetic top very aesthetically pleasing you can sit it on your vanity or whatever and it falls right in with all of your other fragrances what I do is just cut this part what it's inspired by out right here and glue it to my bottles i put like a b-roll in of how i do that or i use my label maker because they do not put what they are inspired by at the bottom and i put that in as a suggestion but they don't i'm trying to see if they do but no it's just a floral jasmine down here so yeah i absolutely love dossier you guys know that so let's just go through the other scents i like that scent but Tom Ford fragrances I always have to grow on me. You guys know that. So this is Giorgio Armani My Way. I do have My Way. Now what I will say about this one that kind of got me like rattled is I'm not really getting my way out of it. I get like a, I get like a tenth of my way. But it still smells good. But now that I say this, when I sprayed it on me the other day, I didn't really get it. I get it now. I get it. So it's not a spot on do, but it smells like it. It is fruity neroli, okay? So one of these, I know for a fact I already got. I just can't remember which one. So this is Woody Sandalwood, and it's inspired by Le Labo 33. This is the one I got. So there's no need for me to keep both of them. I would just end up putting this in a giveaway like I always do. You guys know I'm the giveaway queen and I hold my giveaways over there on Facebook. If you don't have Facebook, I'm sorry. Okay, so here's another one. This is inspired by Valentino Voce, Vo, Voce Viva and it's Powdery Orange Flower. So I do have this fragrance. And I love it. And that smells exactly like it. And this one right here is what got me. It's Spicy Mimosa. And it is inspired by Joe Malone Mimosa and Cardigan Cologne. I did not have this, but I love it so much I went and got it. Because I'm going to spray this out. And so I went on Macari and found um, someone who was selling it with another one in a bundle for like only $80. So score <laughs> but i'm glad i got this one and i don't have on anything today so why not it smells too good to me oh it smells good so that's like daytime airy light so that's all of my new scents from dossier be looking out for a giveaway with the scent that i already have i love to start my luxury hauls off with this video i mean mm -mm. that ain't how you see it <laughs> 
I love to start my luxury hauls off with Dossier because, of course, I'm going to show you guys a lot of high-end perfume. And if you can't afford it or if you don't feel like perfume is worth that amount of money or if you just don't want to spend that amount of money on perfume, I got you here with Dossier. You can go on Dossier website and see if they have a version of it and it's going to smell just like it, okay? So I will leave the link to Dossier below the video. Thank you for sponsoring this video. Let's move on. All right, so let's hop into perfume. Um, let's just start with these because it's not really perfume. Chanel came out with bath bombs. They are called the Chanel Chance So Tender um, Bath Tabs. What are they called, guys? I think they call them bath tabs. It's 10 of them in here, and this is $70. Yeah, scented bath tablets. They are so small, y'all. <laughs> I was not expecting this. But they powerful okay so if this is something you're interested in i got mine from sephora it was a sephora exclusive but now you can buy them off the chanel website so check them out all right so let's hop into amazon fragrances okay most of these i did get during prime of course if you watch my vlogs you have seen all of them so i'm gonna go through them really really quick with the exception of this one this one i asked my cousin we was talking about something and she said what is like your perfect scent and i said you know that scent jergens cherry almond original lotion give off i would love that in a perfume because we were talking about the new kali kali scent is it kali or kali <laughs> so she went and found it for me it is the jergens original scent lotion nope perfume this is what the bottle looked like so here's the thing, it smells exactly like it, except it dries down to like a fresh after shower smell. Here's the thing though, you cannot purchase this anywhere. It was a collaboration they did with influencers for Mother's Day. So the only way you can find this is if it's resale like Macari or something like that. So that's where my cousin got mine from. And then I found another Macari link and linked it and one of you guys snatched it up ASAP. So let's see if we can just tag Jergens and tag this and see if they can bring it back because I don't think it was really expensive, well, if they sold it. Um, and yeah, it's bum. I love it. It's very nostalgic. So next up, I got Casablanca. I have been wanting this forever, but when people like Fumi, me, and all the other people who love perfume talk about scents on Amazon, they hike the prices up. This used to be like $40, and it got all, it's up to like $70 now. So I waited to Prime and snagged it up. I tried to snag Ornament, but they gave me a refund on it, so I don't know what happened. It's very good. I've used quite a bit of it to have so many fragrances and for it to be new. This is my favorite. This smells so freaking good to me. I see, I spray everything I show y'all. This smells really good to me, and I'm so glad I got it. So glad I got it. Out of my Amazon ones, this is the one you need. You really, it smells so good out of this world. And I'm a fruity, but sexy, flirty type person. I'm not into masculine. I'm not into smoky. I'm not into any of that, okay, if that helps. So this is Amber Rouge. Look at this bottle, okay? This, so this is Amber Rouge. It's also from Amazon. Another one of those that were that was cheaper at a point of time, but do what you do. I understand. This is look. Everybody is duping baccarat, but if you want a baccarat dupe, here you go. And look at the bottle. Look at this bottle. It's around seventy bucks. Look. Oh, I was finna spread. Dead smack on baccarat dupe. That's all I gotta say. Then I have been wanting. Swiss Arabian Oud. Now, this is my least favorite, but I'm gonna keep it because they love it so much. I'm just not a Oud girl. I, I am, but not like overpowering. It, it gets, it's too much. You know what I'm saying? But they love it on me, so I'm keeping it for that. And it was only like $40, $50. This is like a cult. For, people who love perfume love this one from Amazon. So yeah, I'm gonna keep it. So, moving off of Amazon, speaking of Kylie, I did get her newest fragrance. Love Fest Burning Cherry. You guys know Kylie can't do wrong in my eyes. Kylie, I'm going to say Kylie, cannot do wrong in my eyes. Every single scent I love. The apple one, mm, it was okay, but I still liked it. Does that make sense? This one right here. 
this is the sexiest cherry I've ever smelled. I've heard it on last. I've heard it's giving tongue for lost cherry. I don't get none of that. It lasts on me. I bore it a good five hours and can still smell it. And I don't get lost cherry at all. Y'all just hear cherry and won't say cherry. As a matter of fact, I don't get lost cherry, but what I do get is House of Siage Cherry Garden. But this is way cheaper, so a fraction of the price. So good job. And she tried 48 times, just in case you didn't know. The number right here is how many times they tested it before they okayed it. All right, so you guys know. No, 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 no. I love Gucci Guilty. I showed this in like my man eater fragrance video. A lot of y'all didn't watch that. Check it out. It's right here. Because y'all had this thing where I post something and y'all don't watch it. Then I post a blog and y'all say, where you been? Where you been? I'm like, girl, I just posted a hair review, a fragrance video. You just didn't watch it. So hit the bell so you'll know when I load a video, okay? So I love Gucci Guilty. This was actually my second bottle. I don't want to throw this bottle away because it's the bling bottle, but I might as well because it looks like so bad. It looks like so bad. And you can't clean that off. So I had to get a fresh bottle and I wanted the old bottle. So I had to go through a source to get this because they have this but in the new bottle and i'm absolutely in love with this design i will tell you the perfume plug or source i went through to get this but let me get their permission first because a lot of people um you know they don't be ready for the traffic i bring and so i have to ask them first to make sure i don't overwhelm them but it's not like the plug like i used to have hush it ain't really no plug like <laughs> you get about ten dollars off but she found the old bottle for me so that's that so let's go into high end baccarat got all us in a chokehold right and y'all know how i love hair mist so i did get the baccarat so i did get the baccarat hair mist my lights are really bright guys so this is not a perfume this is what you spray in your hair you guys know i love hair mist i have so many different type of hair mist in there um i keep them separate from my perfume because i want to be able to grab them walking out the door and just do a little number but come on now if i got see i can wear this and this and nobody ever know i don't really have on baccarat i mean i have baccarat and i have baccarat straight but you get what i'm saying i'm sorry yeah i'm just too frigidy so yeah i got the hair mist and i absolutely love this because y'all who don't wash their weaves with me y'all know that and so i'll be spraying this kind of stuff to get that like process smell out i need to start but child I ain't been doing it for years. Why would I start now? So, y'all are going to think I'm crazy. So, you guys remember from my birthday haul, I had Usain Mood. I love that as a sample. Bought it from, what was that, Sax Bloomingdale? I don't know. Y'all, go back to my birthday vlog. And I got home and I'm like, that Ood is overpowering. Here we go with this dang on Ood. And then I was somewhere and somebody walked by me and they had it on. I'm like... And I got this shit again. What, what is wrong with me? I, I honestly don't know. See, my thing is, you got to learn your fragrances. So, for example, if I'm leaving at the house, I can spray 45 sprays of this and be good. With this and this other stuff I'm going to spray you, just a dibba dabba do you. Because when you start spraying, like Creed Adventures for her do that to me. When you start spraying too much, it just... It don't even give you the original smell anymore. So that's what I have to do with this. Take it light, Nikki. Take it light. I put it on the day I got it and loved it again. I'm just like, what is wrong with me? But like I said, the first two times, y'all know how I go in. You guys see me getting ready. And I do the food. And it was too much. And I smelled too much ooh. So probably ch ch and let it go. <laughs> so... BDK. You guys know I love BDK. I love the owner. He's super nice. I met him. All of my other bottles are signed. Um, I had a traveler set that I got from him and I fell in love with two fragrances. So I did get Velvet Tonka. This is good. Oh! Okay. It's mine. This, this is so good. It's Tonka chocolate. See, I'm not that person into perfume. I just know what smells good and what I want. Oh! That looks kind of weird, don't it? Sorry, I'm busting out everywhere they be. I think 
mm -mm, I still like Pat that Swat the most, but this is good, good. But this is more fall. But what's tripping me out is Suge got in the truck and she said she thought I had on Dior Poison. Y'all know how I feel about Dior Poison. I don't hate it, but it smells like smoking rouge or rouge smoking from BDK. It smells like benevolence from um, House of Siage. So I'm just like, it don't smell like that. Something wrong with your nose, sugar. <laughs> so, when I was talking about Dacia, I told you guys that I found this bundle on Makari. See, Makari is good. I hate I told y'all about it because, yeah, y'all be buying up all the good stuff. When people, like me, when I get tired of a certain scene or when, like, I just bought a new Gentle Fluidy Go. And I only had, like, a little bit left in my old bottle. So, that is good to put on Makari, you know. And so, I be catching some deals on her. So, both of these were 80 bucks. This is Joe Malone Mimosa and Cardamom. By the way, my good sis Peyton is having a meet and greet at the Joe Malone here in Dallas. Contact her IG to see how you can um, RSVP for that. So, this one right here is Vetiver, Vetiver and Golden Vanilla. So, this is the one I really wanted after smelling the Dossier version. And you see how it's hardly some in here. But both of these for 80 These are like 180 each. And so, this one has a lot. Can you guys see it? Hold up. Oh, the bottle dirty. I'm sorry. I should have wiped them. I don't have my phone in here. But this one has like, okay, in case you can't see it, it's right here. Oh, you can see it. It's moving. And I was like, I just want this one, but it's a bundle, so why not? Now, this one, love it, of course. And that's what I was on the hunt for. This one, at first, I was like, mm -mm. I was like, Payne, you can have it, but I sprayed it. And it settled in. I like it. Would I just go and buy it? Absolutely not. But for the deal I got, I'm keeping it. All right. So that's all of the perfume. And let's just hop straight into sunglasses. Let's just keep it going. I've been on sunglasses lately. Why? Because I always have my glasses on. But when I do go out and I pop my ish, I pop my ish. So I got three designer sunglasses. Now, I've been wanting, y'all know, I usually just buy a pair of Versace glasses every year for my birthday. It's like a tradition. But I wanted these Biggie glasses so bad. This is the bigger, bigger, Biggie Medusa head sunglasses. And I can't remember the name of this color. I can't. I'll, I'll leave it below, of course. Um, but it's I didn't want the black ones, but check me out. They like a grayish silver, but they, girl, hold on, I'm just too cute. I'm the dangerous, ain't too many can't hang with us, not this way. <laughs> these things too cute, cause I'm usually an oversized person, but I'm like, these are bum, ooh, bum. So they do have the Medusa heads right here. And they are just lovely. I'm trying to see if there's an item number or something on the side. Baby, I look at these too cute. Too cute. Oh, sorry, y'all. So then, y'all be influencing on here. Y'all be influencing the influencer. Gina did like a $30,000 haul. And she had these glasses. And y'all, I went on Saks Fifth. Hold on, I still got the tag on them. They were originally $395. Saks Fitz had them for $179, and then I was able to use another, they're Gucci by the way, I was able to use another coupon, and it brought them all the way down to like $139, bro, I ain't lying. I don't have to zoom in, you guys can see those pretty good. This is what the back look like. She influenced me to get that, it's like a cream pair too. And see, I want a Gucci pair of glasses with a big G, so I'm going to get one more pair, guys. I want the G's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And who gonna say something? Who gonna say something? All right, so that's that pair right there. Still like the um, Versace pair a little bit more, but those are like a fraction of the Versace pair price. On Gucci again. I, y'all, sorry, these went on sale on Saks too. They were originally, see I'm all on a budget over here. They are originally 565. They marked them down 46% to 299. And then that's all, they were 300. Ooh, hold up. Pose. Ooh, ooh. Stop. 
Well, yellow, stop playing with me. Okay, so they're oversized. This is more brown. I can't tell in the viewfinder. Oh, these were, this is what needed the big G's. The big boys needed the big G's. So I did contemplate on if I was going to keep both. Because it's kind of like, why do I need both? But my cousin said they're not similar enough to just keep one. They're like two different styles, two different colors. Monet said that as well. So, yeah, that's my sunglasses. So then I did get some tennis shoes. Can you guys believe I got some tennis shoes? I only have like one other pair of tennis shoes now. I went on this tennis shoe kick for a moment and then I lost weight and I used to be an eight and a half and now I'm a seven. So I had to give all those shoes away except the purple ones. I kept like a purple pair of Pumas or something. And I only got a Louis Vuitton pair of tennis shoes. So I'm not gonna start a tennis shoe collection cause I'm not that girl. I don't, I'm not a, I've never been a tennis shoe girl. I didn't own a pair of tennis shoes before I got married, honestly. I left some out. I'm going to show y'all. I'm a little parched. Hold on. Look at my cute little glass, y'all. Shoot. I'll link it below. So, I did get these new balances. They just scroll down on a Facebook ad. I got them in the kids size so that they would be cheaper. So they were only like, it's, they never put the price on these receipts. I want to say $65 and they're just cute. New balances. They're burgundy. I just, they are so cute to me. I don't know why. I'm not a burgundy reddish type person, but they scroll down my timeline and I was like, that's so cute. Rah, rah, rah. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I got. So, I did skip this out, but you guys have seen it in a TikTok, a reel, a haul. Versace bring back their backpack set every year, right? I took my lights down just a little bit, guys, because I was mighty bright. So, they bring this back every year, but with a different backpack. This is only like 88 bucks, and you get a backpack, a Versace backpack for free. So, basically, what you're doing is paying for the fragrance. I know that probably irritates y'all. I've been so frigidy doing my videos, but I've been doing it this way for years, y'all. Stop trying to change me. <laughs> so, so you do get a full three ounce fragrance. So I got Versace Bright Crystal. I already have Versace Bright Crystal, but I already have all of Versace scents. So I just wanted the backpack really. So I'm gonna keep the big one cause I have the 1.7 ounce or so the one ounce in my room. I'm gonna give that one to Miss Creative Diva cause she loved this scent. This is literally the scent she wore her wedding day. Um, and I'm gonna keep the big one. Or should I just give her the big one? I just said she loved it and I barely wear it. I'll give her the big one. She, she worked it, she worked it, that's my boom. And this year, this is the backpack. Now, in a vlog, I showed you guys a comparison. All right, guys. So, I'm not impressed with this one. It's, like, really cheapy. Like, I can't. It's just so cheapy feeling. So, I spent that $88. I won't say for nothing because I can give a friend something. But, and then, I don't like how many they put perfumes on here this year. So, I guess they, because each year, this perfumes keep getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Like, I just want my to say Versace. Okay, <laughs> so this is what the back look like. Heads up, if you get a male fragrance, the hardware is always silver on the men and gold on the women. And the men's backpack is a little taller. So it's a little bigger than this one. So if you want to compare it to last year's, here's both. I do like last year's a little bit better. The perfume ain't stamped extra big. I haven't even wore it. Still has the thing on it. It opens up like this and it becomes a little bigger. See? And it doesn't feel cheapy like. I have this one in silver too. Well, I had it. I gifted it to my little cousin for Christmas. So, yeah. That's their summer backpack deal. You can find those on Macy's, Dillard's. I got mine from Sephora. Uh, Ulta. I got mine from Ulta. So, I did get two bougie on a budget bags. I haven't been buying handbags recently because, for one, none of them are here. Remember, I moved all of them out of here. 
somewhere like my high-end ones and so the only ones you'll see is like lower in like kurt geiger or coach or something like that and in the beauty room i was just buying like all of those handbags to fill my rack because you guys know i'm obsessed with purple and i wanted it to all be purple and my bougie person did get two purple bags but i have to go grab them y'all i do i don't even have them with me um yeah oh popcorn let's go back i did get the other bottle when i got the backpack so which bottle should i give miss creative diva comment below <laughs> so um yeah so all of my purple bags and stuff that's literally like props if i want to wear them i will but they're literally like props and as i think about it i'm like girl them things still be high you better get some props from Shein. uh Fashion Nova, I do have some of that from Shane and Fashion Nova, but it's just like, why am I spending all this money on props? Yeah, I'll be making some bad decisions. Let me just get them. So, so I do have three more coming. No, two more coming. Two more coming. Just two. Just two. Um, and then I think I'm a chill. I got enough purple stuff now. And so this is the cousin bag. Now, if you know anything about Louis Vuitton, cousin, the cousin don't even come in this color. <laughs> so this has to be a prop. But it's just so cute to me. Look at it. And so it does have another strap in here. It's black. It has like a little lavender or lilac hardware on it. I actually think that lilac or lavender is my favorite color, not actually purple. But I like all shades of purple. This is just like my favorite shade. So let me zoom in so the color can come out of it. So that's the true color of it right there. And yeah. And so this was like $100. When I could just get, I could get one that looked like this machine for like $17. So I, I learned my lesson. Lesson learned. And I cannot leave the link to where I get this stuff from. Hit me on Instagram or somewhere else and I will happily tell you my best friend sells them and then I have another person that I go through her page got hacked and she has a new page so hit me somewhere else and then I got this Chanel which looks actually looks pink to me so it's just gold hardware it's just a little small bag so this one was only like 70 I want to say they are not the same color though this is what I'm talking about see so I guess this one right here is lavender and this is lilac. This almost looks pink. So that's that. So I have jewelry to show you guys and I'm done. I don't know why I like these Valentino earrings. I've recently just got into designer jewelry. Um, I guess I got enough purses and stuff, right? Um, so I'm going to have a closet clean out too, guys. Don't hold me to it don't rush me do not rush me so let me show you these pieces really really quick um i got some pieces from louis vuitton um i basically got the same thing so i'm gonna show you guys all three of them at the same time i'm into these style bracelets i have one on i got from amazon that looks like a cartier bracelet like i don't care how much money i get i just cannot spend what are those braces seven thousand dollars oh no ma'am no uh uh nope they say never say no but i ain't i ain't got it like that i'm not that youtuber ain't no shame in my game to say that and don't <laughs> and won't and whatever <laughs> so this is the louis vuitton nano the memory card was exhausted i've been doing that much hauling nanogram bracelet okay so y'all know how i am if i like something i get it in all three hardwares so you got the rose gold the silver and the gold love these bracelets look at that look at that i got all three of these for a fraction of what a cartier bracelet is and it's giving very much cartier feel right i mean a fraction all three of them together was a fraction still of what a real Cartier would be. I think they were like six, seven each. Okay. I am in love with these braces. Absolutely love them. I only got two more pieces of jewelry to show y'all. Why? Well, I just thought I had a lot of stuff. 
Okay, so these two came from Versace. Follow me, guys. I always announce when Versace have sales and all that. They mark so many of their robes and stuff down, and I was fighting the temptations to get another one, but I don't need another one. So I bought that pretty good because I have three of them. My purple one is too big, but I can't let that go. It's limited edition. Purple, you can't even get it down, so I have to keep that. So, okay, this was not on sale. This is the Medusa chain. It's a necklace. I love a gold chain necklace, and I need another one. So I just went ahead and got the Versace one. So that's what that looked like right there. Good sturdy jewelry. I don't know why I feel like something missing. Okay, so these were on sale. So they're not available anymore because they snatched them up when they went on sale, honey. These are earrings. I forgot what these are called. I will still link them. You might can find a resale. Um, they have like a loop inside of a hoop. So this is what you have right here. They say, oops, they say Versace. Sorry, the camera is always backwards. They have a little Medusa head right here. And then the inside just has like the, girl, I want to say barbacoa, but y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> the bar, what is it called? Barcua? I don't know, print. So that's everything. I hope I didn't leave anything out. I will leave the links to everything below. Don't forget to check out Dossier. And everything I have on will be below. This is a Shein dress. Apple Watch Band from Amazon. See, it's backwards in the viewfinder. Apple Watch Band from Amazon. Cartier Dupe Bangle from Amazon. It's only like six, seven, eight dollars And Valentino earrings. And this is um, the wig from my last vlog. I just pinned it up. I can't remember the name. So, yeah, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be doing any more luxury hauls. I'll bring you guys hauls, but not luxury hauls. I'm going to chill out on buying all this kind of stuff for a minute. I mean, well, as you guys can see, I already have, like, it ain't nowhere not like what I used to spend. Because it's just like, girl, you got enough stuff, start wearing it or giving away old stuff. Stop, Start spending your money on something else. My baby a whole senior. She's a whole senior, and we got other things to do. Um, yeah, so that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.